Well, hello. Hello. Are you ready to have some fun? You know who you have here? This is Dixie, and guess what this is? Dixie's Reading Corner. And today we're gonna learn about Marjorie Merriweather Post. I'm gonna fill your face with a lot of knowledge. Marjorie Merriweather Post was a rich socialite and the heiress to the Post Foods Corporation. It was her idea to start putting toys in cereal boxes. In 1965, The Who released their first album and Marjorie was instantly hooked. This story sucks! This story what? This story what? Really? 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 So anyways, later that year, Marjorie ran into Columbia developer James Rouse at a party. They made a bet to see who could bong the most beers. Guess who won? Marjorie. So by the terms of the bet, Mr. Rouse had to name his new concert pavilion after Marjorie. Marjorie insisted that Meriwether Post Pavilion host The Who in 1969 with Led Zeppelin as their opener. Although Marjorie was pronounced dead shortly after the show, she still gives the bands hardwood. The same hardwood that's been on that stage for 40 years. The end. Are you bored? Is there something I can do to entertain you? Huh?